over the weekend, we debuted the team that wouldn't be here during the AFC and NFC championship games. The campaign puts a spotlight on 12 NFL stars and the first responders who saved their lives. When I came across Carson, he just like he'd been to the meat grinder. It was raining pretty hard. I could hear people inside the vehicle screaming. He was bloody. We had to pretty much rip the car open and pull him out. It's a powerful ad, but this campaign is about so much more. We're encouraging everyone to visit allourthanks.com to get a more in-depth look at the stories featured. And when you share these stories on social with hashtag allourthanks, Verizon will donate $1 up to $1.5 million to First Responders Outreach. They provide critical funding for emergency relief, training, and essential equipment to ensure these heroes perform to the best of their abilities. On allourthanks.com, there's also a place where you can upload your own photo and personal message to thank First Responders. Last week, I also caught up with Diego Scotti on another cool element of this campaign, a documentary. The 12 uh, mini films uh, will live on a website online. Uh, we are going to even create a 30 minute documentary uh, that tells the story from uh, the side of the first responders to show uh, not only our uh, appreciation, but also to help everybody uh, get a deeper, uh, a bit deeper understanding of what the first responders do. Stay tuned later this week for details on a screening of the documentary for employees. And to wrap it up for today, as we focus on first responders who are there for others in their time of need, we wanted to share this story from ordinary citizen and V-teamer Richard Metro, who works on the finance team in Lake Mary, Florida. When his neighbor's home caught on fire, Richard's quick thinking helped wake her up and save her from the blaze. Thanks, Richard, for running to a crisis. But the good deeds don't end there. We recently got this note from VerizonWireless.com. I'm 83 years old, retired. Here in St. Louis, we just had a 12-inch plus snowfall, and not once, but twice, our next-door neighbor, a Verizon employee named David Allen, stole all the snow from our driveway and walk. Please take appropriate action against such an individual. David does indeed work for the company as an account manager in Indirect. And David, way to go and keep on stealing that snow. Well, that'll do it for us today. Have a great day, everyone. Until next time, you're up to speed.